burgers, meatballs, even chicken nuggets. Mush Foods, an Israeli food tech startup, is launching what it calls the hybrid meat revolution. The magic ingredient is mycelium, a type of mushroom that grows from food waste. It's animal-free, cost-effective, and good for you. But unlike other vegan products, Mush Foods is not trying to replace meat. Instead, they're targeting meat lovers. I believe we already have enough solution for the vegan people. Uh, I'm not sure if you know, but you know, the meat market, it's $1.5 trillion a year, okay? Only tiny, small fractions of it, less than 1.5%, it's meat alternatives. If you ask me why, I like meat, and I'm not going to be vegan. If you ask most of the people here, they're not vegan. And I'm telling you the truth, they're not going to be. Cooking the mycelium is simple. It's mixed together with beef or chicken to create a hybrid product that's half meat, half mushroom. The goal is to drastically reduce the global consumption of animal proteins and food waste. Whether it's beef, chicken, fish, seafood or pork, we know how to combine these proteins together with the mycelium to create a 50-50 mixture. This not only cuts down on meat consumption and costs, but also makes the final product healthier and more flavorful. The company is planning to launch this new food technology in restaurants across Tel Aviv, including right here at the Margoza Bar in Yafo. No binders or fats are added. Mush Foods say they're growing 14 different species of mycelium using a special technology and solid-state fermentation process in vertical farms. The fungus grows quickly and is ready for consumption in just a matter of days. You, it's better for you in terms of nutrition and the value. Because when I'm reducing 50% of the meat, I'm reducing 50% of the cholesterol from the saturated fat, 20 something percent of the calories, while maintaining a high, high and good level of protein, plus fibers, vitamin D, and other initiatives that it's better for you. So, how does it taste? The food was great. I couldn't taste the difference between this and regular meat. I really enjoyed it. I've tried many different meat alternatives, and they always have a strange taste. I didn't personally like Beyond Meat at all, because I didn't feel it tasted like meat. But this tastes like real food, like meat. The next step is to launch Mush Foods in America and scale up, which means this innovative mushroom could soon find its way to a restaurant near you. I hope that during October, November, we'll start big pilots in the U.S. also, in the New York area. Uh, we're going to feed actually 6,000 people uh, with our products as a pilot for now. From Tel Aviv, Maya Margit, reporting for The Media Line.